the crime boss of a Salford family will have to look over his shoulder for the most of the rest of his life after plotting the mad robbery of a notorious Liverpool gang. Jason Cox joined forces with Liverpoolian criminal Richard Caswell to storm a stash house operated by an organised crime group based in the city, which Cox described as the biggest firm in Liverpool, which is madness. Cox's brother, Craig Cox and Caswell, burst into the stash house on a residential street in Liverpool on a Saturday morning after another robber pretended to be a delivery driver and knocked on the front door when they burst in. A father and son inside the house were slashed and beaten with an axe and a machete. Moments later, the robbers fled with about 30 kilos of cocaine worth up to one million and left a trail of blood in their wake. Manchester Crown Court heard, as he was jailed for almost 15 years, Jason Cox's lawyer said he will now have to look over his shoulder for the most of the rest of his life. Caswell's lawyer said he is under threat in prison and has become a target. He was reportedly slashed in prison previously. Jason Cox was sentenced to 14 years and 8 months in prison. His brother was sentenced to 13 and a half years, and Caswell nicknamed Will because of the apparent resemblance to the pop star Will Young, received 7 years. Another Cox brother, Lee Cox, was jailed for 8 years for his involvement in the family's brazen drug business. Prosecutors told how the tight-knit Cox crime gang were involved in the large-scale sophisticated drug dealing, being linked to more than 20 kilos of cocaine and 50 kilos of cannabis. Jason Cox decided to join forces with Caswell, a well-known Liverpool criminal, previously linked to a spate of car bombs across the city in 2003 and 2004 to target another drug dealing group. The identity of the gang can't be revealed for legal reasons. Jason Cox described a member of the gang as a horrible nasty piece of work, of work in discussions with Caswell, recovered through the hacking of the EncroChat network. Caswell told Cox, if we get his driver, do you think he will be the man with access to Gaff? With it all in, he added, I would even be up for killing him if needs be. The pair talked about using a tracking device with Cox, asking Caswell whether he believed the gang would be wary of such tactics. Yes, Caswell replied, they have been at it for some years. If they suspected us, they would want us to put us on a lie detector. We need to be spot on with this. Jason Cox and Caswell made at least five surveillance trips to scope out the stash house prior to the robbery which took place on Saturday, May the 23rd, 2020. Craig Cox was recruited alongside foot soldier Ben Monks Gorton, who was tasked with posing as a delivery driver. He knocked on the front door of the house with a cardboard box in his hand before robbers piled in. The victims were seriously hurt, with one suffering a severe gaping wound which exposed his bone. The robbers fled with about one million in cocaine in several bags, leaving in a van. Monks Gorton had been wearing a COVID mask, and in the struggle it fell off. His DNA was found on the mask by police. Jason Cox and Richard Caswell split the proceeds of the raid in half between them. Cox sold on his share of the gains to Leon Atkinson, a notorious drug dealer and associate of cop killer Dale Cregan who was jailed for 15 years last year for his involvement in a huge cocaine ring. Couriers linked Cox and Atkinson met near Manchester City's training ground on two occasions to organise the handover. The password agreed between them was decided as Man City. In the aftermath of the robbery, in messages, Jason Cox told how he'd got 13 kilos of cocaine from the biggest firm in Liverpool. That they were not telling a soul and keeping quiet. Cox told how he had to chop him up badly in his gaffy during the robbery. Later, Jason Cox and Lee Cox fled to Spain and had to be dragged back to the UK to face justice. All three brothers and Caswell were sentenced by Judge Patrick Field, KC.
He said of the raid, it was a meticulously executed crime committed by greedy and desperate criminals and demonstrated, I suppose, that there is no honour among drug traffickers. Jason Cox, 37, of Warrington, Craig Cox, 34, of No Fixed Address, Caswell, 41, of No Fixed Address, and Monks Garton, of No Fixed Address, all pleaded guilty to conspiracy to rob. Jason Cox, Craig Cox, Lee Cox, 39, of Oakland's Road, Salford, all pleaded guilty to conspiracy to supply cocaine and cannabis and conspiracy to possess criminal property. Caswell also admitted conspiracy to supply cocaine and heroin and possession criminal property. Monks Gorton was jailed for six years and nine months at a previous hearing. Please like this video, please comment and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you.